Hey guys, are you here bringing you another video? Today I want to talk about calories, calorie surplus, calorie deficits, calorie maintenance, what all that means, and uh, my calorie intake and what my goals are. So, um, calorie is just a unit of measurement. It is in most of our foods and what we drink. And uh, basic calorie maintenance is eating about the same amount of calories that you're consuming each or um, burning off each day or what your body is naturally burning each day. So say at around 2,000 calories um, daily intake, you aren't gaining weight or losing weight. You're just staying about the same at about, say, th these are just uh, rough estimates maybe for me. Um, I'm, I'm a lot smaller though, so maybe at 2,400 calories I am gaining weight and at about 1,700 or 1,800 calories, I'm losing weight. So all these numbers you want to keep in mind based on your goals. Um, for me, my goal right now, I'm actually going to turn the other way, um, construction that way. Um, for me, my goals right now are I want to gain probably another 10 pounds or so of lean muscle. It's going to be pretty hard to put on lean muscle if I'm in a deficit, so I'm going to be in a slight surplus. What this means is I'm going to be eating at around 2,400 calories. I'm going to slowly, slowly, slowly put on weight, but um, this weight is going to be pretty lean. I'm going to try to keep off as much fat as I can. What happens is, in a surplus, if you go too high on calories, say you go to like, for me, 26, 27, 2,800 calories, you're going to gain the weight much quicker, and people call these bulk phases, and that's, that's good. But what happens is you're going to gain, um, say, 10 pounds and 5 pounds of that's going to be fat, 5 pounds of it's going to be muscle. And it depends a lot of what your macronutrients look like, like we talked about yesterday, if you're eating lean, if you're not eating lean, etc. What I'm doing right now is just a nice, slow bulk, putting on, um, putting on weight very slowly, but the weight I am putting on is very lean, trying to keep my body fat nice and low. And those are my goals. Sorry if you can hear that bird up there. <laughs> um, so say someone that's trying to lose weight, um, one of the biggest factors you should be looking at is um, your calories. And if you're in a calorie deficit, you are going to lose weight. There's no, I mean, that's just what the science shows. There's no if, ands, or buts. If you're in a calorie deficit, you're going to lose weight. If you're in a calorie surplus, you're going to gain weight. Calorie maintenance, like I said, is just eating around maintenance. You're not going to lose or gain weight. And um, yeah, so if you want to lose weight, just eat in a calorie deficit. Keep those macronutrients in line so your body can function properly. And if you want to gain weight, eat in a calorie surplus. So one of the important things I want to talk about in this video, hopefully this wind isn't too loud, is staying at a slight surplus or a slight deficit. So the problem with going too low in calories is that it's not sustainable. If you say you're gonna, your maintenance say is 2,000 calories and you're gonna lose a little bit of weight at 1,800 calories, that's about what I would recommend. If you're going to 15, 1,500 calories, 1,400 calories, 1,300 calories because you wanna cut a bunch of weight really fast, yeah, it might work. You might cut a, a lot of weight really fast, but the problem is, since you're practically starving yourself, what you're gonna do is end up binge eating. You're gonna put all the weight back on because, I mean, 1,300 calories isn't sustainable, especially if you're working out hard, you're busy, uh, there's cars that way. Um, you're busy and, um, you know, you, you're just not gonna be able to keep up a 1,300, 1,400 calorie diet. Um, so basically what's gonna happen is you're gonna drop a bunch of weight, you're gonna, you're gonna fall off your diet, you're gonna gain it all back, and all that work you did was literally for nothing. So what I, what I like to say is that if you wanna lose weight, go in a slight deficit, make it comfortable, eat a little bit less, and at times you can go back to your maintenance. Maybe eat at a deficit for a few weeks, go back to maintenance, eat at a deficit for a few weeks, go back to maintenance, and what this does is it makes it very enjoyable, very sustainable, and you can lose weight and keep it off. Um, same thing with a surplus. Um, if you want to gain weight, don't just put your calories at three or four thousand. I mean, everyone has different goals. So, so if you're bulking up for say football or a sport, something like that might be totally, totally fine. But um, for me, I'm just looking to put on lean muscle, and I don't mind if it takes a little bit longer. I want to just look good in the process, enjoy it, and keep it sustainable. My big thing is sustainability. So. For me, going a little bit over my maintenance. I'm going a couple hundred calories over my maintenance. Some days I might just go to 2,100 calories, 2,200 calories. I'm not a big eater, so for me it's actually pretty difficult. Ah, oh, stupid bird, man. <laughs> but um, yeah, so you know, I eat about 2,400 calories and uh, I've been putting on a little bit of weight, 
little bit of weight. I'm, I'm totally fine with the, the process being nice and slow, but enjoying it and being able to keep the weight that I do gain and have my weight that I put on be lean muscle instead of fat and just looking good the whole time. So that's it about calories, guys. Didn't talk about calories too much in the last video, so I wanted to bring it up today. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys wanna see next. Um, and if you enjoy these type of videos, just let me know. Thank you so much for watching. Give the video a big thumbs up and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.